Hey y'all. And yes, y'all have got a gangsterling. But like I said, I got y'all balanced and so we're just gonna have to go with it. I know y'all said to go get a tripod, but y'all I can't do that right now. I got too much shit to do. And we definitely can't do it right now anyway because uh we went to go get the tire patched at discount tire because they do it for free. The whole dang tire had to be replaced. I was like, son of a bitch. So y'all know, and, and I'm fiddling with stuff, guys, because I'm just now was able to get away. Love bug had to work. So I've had to be stay-at-home mommy with Daisy again and haven't had any time. Usually the weekends I have time to myself to come in here and work. So I figured while I'm working and I know that's gonna bother some y'all. While I'm working, I was gonna talk to y'all real quick. Um, like I said, I know some of that bothers y'all because I'm moving and stuff and some of y'all can't handle that. I get that. So, good shit right there. Um, anyway, so Joe had to work. And then the tire, it wasn't no cheap tire either. We had to have a truck tire. And because everything around here is caliche, if y'all are not, don't understand what caliche is, I cannot explain it to you very well. It's like crushed up limestone. It's hard as rock. They use it around here to pave roads because it sets up so hard. And we were getting them, we got one tire messed up with that. This new tire, this tire that, that just got pierced was mesquite tree thorn. We don't have trees here. We have mesquite bushes. We don't have trees. Um, well, I take that back. My neighbor has got a tree, but it's mostly mesquite trees or bushes or whatever. So we had one of those in the tire on the sidewall, so we had to replace that. I'm like, Dad, that was like a two hundred dollar tire. And uh, but we got all terrain this time, and we're gonna get the other one payday. But we needed something a little heavier duty, because that's all we run is caliche. And, uh, it's just, it's just crazy. So, uh, other than that, working, I'm finally getting in here to work on my quilt. Start, you know, I, I got some squares done the other day and getting those dealt with. Um, I was started using, let's see if I have any, I started using purple bobbin thread. Because I was like, you know what, nobody's going to see the back side of these. So why not use my little bits and bobs of bobbin thread because nobody's going to see it, you know? Might as well use that shit up. So, anyway, my dog is barking about something. My, he just called her a butt nugget. <laughs> she must have been doing something bad. Anyway, so I'm going to make... I think one more set of seven and that'll make it wide enough and then I'm gonna sew it together and it'll almost fit a king bed I think I think and uh, I can't wait to get it together y'all this is so good and I love coming back here I call it my cowgirl retreat I need a sign for my door but um because I have a curtain see my curtain but uh and then I put in my music, my heart radio, a little Chris Ledoux. I have a weird collection of music stations. It's either Chris Ledoux, Nickelback, Brian Adams, the 80s, or One Hit Wonders. I'm an 80s girl. Oh my god, music was so good back in the 80s. Oh, what has happened to music? Now it's all a bunch of hoes shaking their dirty asses on TV and... Or the music videos, and it's just like, oh, my poor kids are watching this crap. Thankfully, my kids are country, but they still see it. Back in the 80s, we didn't have that really. We just had crazy hair and neon colored underpants. I mean, I'm just glad I was one of those that made it in the world before social media. Because <laughs> I probably would have... <laughs> I've been on one of those compilation videos. <laughs> I'm just glad that I, I, I was raised before that. But anyway, guys, I'm going to quit rambling. 
I'm gonna get my quilting on, cause uh, he all comes on at seven, so you know I gotta get my quilt on. But uh, anyway, guys, if y'all missed the NASCAR race tonight or this, yeah, earlier, it was really good. the The end was spectacular. They were racing so dirty. They're gonna need some Dawn soap after that race. Just what? Just look up the end. You don't even need to watch the first part of the race. Just the last five laps. You're gonna need some Dawn soap for that race all day long. Anyway, guys, love y'all.